The magic of printing is usually hidden in the sheds, workshops and studios of printers and designers. At Ditchling Museum of Art and Craft, we want to reveal this process for everybody to see, but we won't be using a printing press and we won't be selling tickets to an open studio. Instead, we're going to take a vintage steamroller on tour and use it as a giant printing press. Ditchling is home to a rich heritage of printing. Eric Gill made over 400 wood engravings when he lived here and along with David Jones and Philip Haygreen, Ditchling was a major player in the 20th century wood engraving revival. In 1916, Hilary Pepler bought the Stanhope Press to Ditchling and formed the Ditchling Press along with Eric Gill and on it they produced tiny beer labels for the local pub, books and huge posters. We're really passionate about printing at the museum and we want to share this with loads of people by taking our vintage steamroller on tour and printing outside in extraordinary places where people can see the spectacle for free. We'll be printing in Ambley Museum in West Sussex, at the London Transport Museum's Acton Depot, in Brighton as part of Brighton Festival and in Ditchling at the Village Fair. What's even more exciting is that we will be working with lots of fantastic artists like Rob Ryan, Angie Lewing and Anthony Burrell. Along with students from primary schools, colleges and universities who will all be producing their biggest ever work to be revealed for the very first time hot off the steamroller press. At the end of the tour, the works will be exhibited at the Phoenix Gallery in Brighton. We need £12,500 to make this theatrical mix of steam and ink happen. And in return for some great rewards, you will be able to see artists at work and be with them as they see, for the first time, their creations revealed.